So Carrie Ann, what does conveys mean? Um, conveys means how he shows. Awesome. And speaking of showing, we're gonna talk about how you plan on showing your community commitments today. Because we have community commitments at our school, we're really pushing our students to be their best self. Because in addition to the academic achievement that we want our students to reach, they also have a foundation for character development. What community commitments do we need to show? for Renaissance, we are preparing our students to be contributors to the world when they graduate and while they're here at the school. If you step into any classroom, you're going to see an intentional focus on character development, so you're going to see the community commitments. We chose responsibility and courage for the character traits today. Our school has identified these seven character traits that we think strong citizens should possess. Respect, responsibility, friendship, courage, self-discipline, perseverance, and cultural sensitivity. Those are the community commitments. We can have the courage to take the responsibility, to take the information that we learn in school, and try to apply that into our own lives. The community commitments allow students to get involved in the class because they're supported by this community of respect and friendship. How do we plan on showing our community commitments? I like to let the students pick which community commitments they think are gonna need to be used during a lesson. Marilise. Responsibility. Responsibility. I'll oftentimes give them a write-up of what we're doing today and then you tell me which community commitments you need to show in order to succeed. Alyssa. Friendship. Friendship. This is a super important one for today's lesson. They'll say, you know, I think I'm going to be working with somebody, so I need to show friendship. And from there, I ask them, well, what does it look like? What does it sound like to show friendship today? It's so important to ask students to help them understand what your expectations are. Kevin. If you're disagreeing with someone, you can be kind about it and not be rude. So often, teachers are like, OK, you need to show x, y, and z. But students are left trying to figure out, well, what does she want me to, what is, what am I actually supposed to do? How are we gonna show perseverance and using up that entire time? Nyasia. We want to add more and revise more. So we wanna make sure we're going back and adding. Questions? All right, let's begin. They help us learn because it keeps us in a very safe environment and a more kindly, friendly environment. So we can all learn, we can all use each other as our learning tools. Let's take a second to go back to our community commitments. You're showing respect because you're listening to me all the time I was talking, even though it took up the whole time. Community commitments exist to remind students of here are seven character traits that will allow you to be successful within our school community. Alyssa. She gave me some cool feedback. She said that maybe I could like <laughs> add less details and get where I'm trying to get to. I personally love the community commitments. That's my favorite part of teaching at Renaissance specifically because I think it just makes character building so real. She wasn't being rude, but she was toting her respectfully. Mm -hmm.